What is good C-Squad? Today we're watching some more Bridge Kids. You guys seem to like the last video, so why not? And just a reminder, these videos are on YouTube. I will put a link to the original channel in the description. I won't, I won't sit in there. God, God damn it. So you said you have like a condition or something? Oh shit, he's coming. Yeah. Oh no, Mr. Pumped Up kicks his back. Oh hey, what's uh, I got something here. Oh, what's that? Do you know anybody named uh, Isaiah? Uh, no, I've never heard of that name. Looks like it's for a birthday party. What the hell does it say? We can make them pay and inflict Justin upon those Cretans. And that's why I'd like to invite you to my birthday. Isaiah. If any of you are named Isaiah watching this, I am sorry. What the hell? Where's my invitation? Oh, hey, I see you got the party invite. I guess I'll catch you there. By the way, somebody in the last video said this kid's nose looks just like Voldemort's. Now I can't unsee it. Thanks, guys. It's okay, you know, I, I didn't even want to go anyway. Well, no, you and I are both going to this party. Uh... Yeah, our invite was probably just like a, a lump invite, like we're each other's plus one. He's probably just trying to save paper. Yeah, that's that makes sense. I genuinely hate people like this. I hate it when people include themselves even when they're not strictly invited to things. It just grinds in my gears. I hate it. Oh god, he's not showing up, is he? It's getting late. Why would he even show up? Oh, look at this room. That litter box has not been changed in a very long time. You know what, it's fine. I don't have time for friends anyway. There's too much that needs to be done. Does that outlet have double switches? I've never seen an outlet with two switches on it. Is that normal? It looks like you brought a friend. That's, um... This is, this is Isaiah's house, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, this is it. The, why don't you come on in? Ah, uh, make yourselves at home. Jesus, the silence in the background is so loud. I know that doesn't make any sense, but trust me, it does. Oh, uh, you, you can leave your shoes at the door. Uh, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just gonna say I would not take my shoes off in this house. I just love the absolute silence after that. Uh, yeah, this is, uh, for you. Oh, wow. Thanks so much. That's, that's awesome. Thanks. Here, yeah, you can, yeah, take this. Wow. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. I blew it up myself, so, uh... Nice work. You're welcome. At least the pumped up kicks kid, aka Isaiah, actually seems like he's grateful for these gifts, because I'm assuming he's never had an actual birthday party before. I don't know, it's kind of sweet. Do you have anything to, like, um, do? Yeah, is there... There's, uh, lots of cool stuff in my room, if you guys want to come check it out. Okay. Uh, I guess, yeah. yeah. Oh lord, we're gonna see his room. Alright guys, so, uh, yeah, this is it. This is my bedroom. It's where the, uh... Magic happens, as they say, so, you know, sorry, it's like, it's it's a little cramped in here. Full disclosure, I wasn't expecting this many people to show up. What the fuck? Excuse my French, but what? I'm not gonna lie, out of everything in this room, the fact that he has a blueprint of his high school, that is bad. That is terrible. However, I will say, he does have a Doom poster, which is a plus. Yeah, this is, uh... a lot of garbage. It, are those, uh, are those animal bones? Oh, do you like them? I actually love collecting these things. I will admit, it is kind of weird to have animal bones in your room. But hey, if scientists do it, then I don't see the problem. Maybe our friend Isaiah here is an aspiring scientist. Hey, do you have any, um, snacks? Uh, what? Snacks? Well, um, well you know, it's like a, a party, so I thought there'd be like, you know... You know, oh. snacks or something. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, snacks, snacks. How could I have forgotten? Um, God, the fucking silence is so loud here. It's so unnerving. Only one way to find out, though, right? Yeah, I guess we could, like, take a look, you know. Yeah, I think we should, um, I think, I think we should leave. I think it's time to go. <laughs> Oh my god, I can only imagine what's under that bed sheet. I don't know, I just love their reaction. It was funny, I like it. I'm gonna assume there's probably a dead body under there. Oh god, you idiot. You forget snacks. There isn't even anything in here. What kind of selfish idiot drags people over to his house and he doesn't even have snacks? Side note, where are his parents? I mean, I guess they could be at work. Or what's under his bed could be his parent or parents. Uh, and yeah, he does as well. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that, yeah. That's what I mean when I say that we double booked is because mm -hmm. we both have 
uh, an appointment. Yeah, we did it together. I mean, was it the was it the snacks? I, I I know it's such a mess in here. I mean, was it the snacks, dude? Oh my god, was it the fucking snacks? Yeah, yeah, that was it. Definitely not the dead body under your bed. All right, guys. Well, thanks so much for coming. You know, I really cherish your friendship and. Yeah. No. No. Um. No problem. Mm hmm Yeah, we, we had fun. Yeah. This was honestly one of the best days of my life. Him saying that was sad as shit. The thing is, I actually believe the guy. Like, I feel bad for Isaiah. This character, Isaiah, is perfect because you slightly feel bad for the guy until you realize he's a murderous psychopath. Oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to laugh at this kid's misery. Look, I'm not trying to be resentful to this murderous psychopath, but oh my god, it's just it's just so funny, dude. It's so funny. But I'm a creep. Wait, their names are Fugger and Lars? She she actually lives upstate. But uh, you know, sometimes she'll she'll drive in and visit, and uh, I'll, I'll I'll sneak her in my house at night. Wow. Yeah, you know, we we gotta be real quiet, uh, so my so I don't wake my parents up while we're uh, while we're making out. Jesus, with that fucking mouth, I don't even know how you would make out. Oh my god, I just imagined him trying to. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna say it. We we got together for like one last uh, goodbye hookup. Uh, uh, we got to third base together. Oh hey guys, oh my gosh, you look so hot in that jacket. You could use a stroke. What? what? Me and Fugger just said the same thing. I hate that his name is Fugger. Chemicals in it. Oh. I saw it has like a yellow number five. Oh, what's, what's that do? Yeah, that's supposed to like uh, lower your sperm count. Uh, oh, you're counting your sperm? <laughs> <laughs> just the way he said that. I don't know. It just sounded so condescending. That delivery was just so funny. Also, people like this who are so picky on what they drink, unless it's water, everything you drink nowadays is pretty bad for you if you're looking for people to uh to prowl on you know she's pretty uh oh her well i guess she's conventionally attractive but she's breathtaking i i consider myself like a sapiosexual what the fuck does that mean sapiosexual of relating to or characterized by sexual or romantic attraction to highly intelligent people that's a thing you know what between you and me that's not really the best flavor let me get you something special Hey, Joey, can you take care of him? Oh, wait, but- Hey, what's up, man? Uh, wait, you wanted a, a different flavor? Holy fuck. It looks like his pants are about to fall off. His pants are being held up by his ginormous cock. Yeah, uh, black cherry is, a, is supposed to be like a, an aphrodisiac in most cultures. Uh, plus her, like, her body language was, like, completely indicating that, that she was totally into me. <sighs> that's, that's pretty serious. Did yeah, her you, pelvis uh... was facing me. <laughs> Okay, that, <laughs> that was pretty good. You might be like her her boyfriend, you know? They're pretty close. Standing well, pretty close together. Well, no, that can't be possible because that would be, uh, they work together. I thought he was going to say something completely different. Hey, hey, again. Oh, hey, back again? Hey, yeah. Uh, wow, you must really like these. <laughs> yeah, you guys do a, a good job, um, uh... You know, um, what are you saying? I feel so bad for Flugger and I want to make fun of him, but, but come on, let's be honest, guys. We've all been there. Also, I'm pretty sure he's like a freshman, so I don't even know. Bro, I am fucking pumped, dude. I can't wait to fucking pump some iron, dog. Yeah, me too, man. I think it's going to be like an upper body day, you know? <laughs> Get it? This show is amazing. I mean, you like uh, you like music and stuff. Like, I mean, I I'm a I'm a big G Unit head. I've been listening to some D Block lately. You know. Why does he keep looking at his crotch? Hey, can you like chug this real quick? Oh, all right. Holy shit! This guy has slammed down four of these things in a matter of five minutes. Ener energized. I just kind of feel like. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, like a pain in my chest. Hey, can't give me those. You know, my heart's beating really fast. I don't. All right, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Oh no, our boy's about to crash and die. Hell yeah, man. We we're trying to pump some iron. I mean, you know, count me in. Yo, Yo. for real, dog. That's what's up. Let's That's go. what's up, bro. I'm fucking hype. Let's go. Joey, where are you going? We're in the middle of our shift. His name is Joey. That's the last name I would have guessed. Yeah. So, anyways, uh, she. It does seem like she doesn't want to be another notch on my belt. Uh, which I understand, but like. 
really, she doesn't know what she's missing out hey, on. Hey, uh, can I get your name and number here? Nice visual show. Amazing. I love it. Also, Fugger is so full of himself. Oh, uh, okay. Bye. Take a look! Her name was Strokeette?